Yeah. So, I mean, oh man, one of the reasons that it took me 30 years, 30, almost 40 years, <laughs> I just didn't think my story was that powerful, Jeff. And I, I really feel like we as people don't recognize how powerful our message is. So I think one of the things we can just not give ourselves permission to step forward and start to experiment, share this message that was in our heart a little bit, see people's response, reaction, you know, see how it's going. So I feel like people don't know if their story's good, if what they have to say is valuable, if it's going to actually help anybody. And I think how I would, if you're, if you're listening or watching, and if you may feel like that, I mean, just, that is the story that's in all of our minds. That is like, what is happening to everyone, almost everyone. There's two people who are like crazy narcissists and they're like, listen to me, but like that the majority of people like, so it's just understand it's going to feel like that until you do it the first time, until you see how much it helps people. And it's really, Jeff, it's crazy how selfish in many ways because we're thinking so much about ourself and we're not keeping the focus on the people we need to help okay so that 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 really holds people back and i think you know we you give yourself permission to share your story and understand it is going to be life-changing even if it was only life-changing for one person would it be worth it for you to share the thing that like the tips the experiences you got through some trauma you got through some hard things you overcame some obstacles you have a successful family you have a successful business you have a successful strategies like like you, what you're sitting on is literally unlocking the key to someone's destiny so my encouragement is your story matters it really does so so that holds us back, Jeff. 